Hello YouTube world and the world beyond the world. This is QB Bianca coming to you all with a new video. I wanted to start off by saying hello everyone. I miss everyone here on YouTube. It's been some time since I've been on here. Um, of course, I've been busy. We've all been busy. Um, also to my special hello to all my purse divas and uh, to all my Dooney sisters and everything. I think we all have kind of taken a break um, from all like new purchases and stuff as it relates to Dooney because they gotten rid of the whole point system or they're getting rid of the points and they're changing some things. So, oh, so let me tell y'all about that. So first let me start off with that. <clears throat> They have now where you can, you can do a text message. So, Dooney sent me an email. Dooney and Bert sent me an email. And they said, send us a text message. Uh, send a text message to this number, two, three, whatever. And you'll be uh, notified of special offers and VIP and stuff like that. So, that's something new, I guess, that they're adding to the app some revising and revamping that they're doing. But today, YouTube world and the world beyond the world. <laughs> I'm coming to you motherfuckers live because it's been a minute since I've been on here. I'm so excited because it's been so long since I've been on here. I hope everyone is doing okay. I hope everyone is beautiful. I'm being extra today because look, I went and got me some Bojangles, but I've been drinking today. Excuse me, um, this video is for adults and adults only. If you are a child, please do not tune in. But Miss Bianca didn't have her little sip today because these people didn't got on my motherfucking nerve all motherfucking week. So I had to come on motherfucking YouTube. <laughs> oh, let me stop cussing. Come on YouTube to give you guys a video about a product for all my divas out here. Y'all is going to love this. This, If you from the Midwest, I don't give a dog on. If you from the Midwest, the East Coast, the West Coast, from the South, wherever, out the country, London, wherever you at, you have been inspired and you have been touched by a D girl. And when I say a D girl, I'm talking about a girl from Detroit. Okay, ain't nothing like us. Biggie said it. Pink Sting Gators by Detroit players. Okay, know that. We the original hair capital. Gator capital. Jewelry. Minks. Furs. Independence. First place where people from the South come and got good paying jobs. Detroit is the history of black. America. And if you notice, I didn't say African American. I said Black America. Because it's the difference between an African American and a Black American. But let me come to y'all with this product. Straight out the 3 1 motherfucker 3. And I want to say a special shout out to everyone I love. Nobody ain't been to visit. It's been some time. I moved. But I carry Detroit with me everywhere I go. Detroit versus everybody, baby. I love my city, okay? So, this is the part I'm doing an unboxing. Okay. So, the product that I am coming to you all about, um, I'm sure there are a plenty of YouTube videos about this lady who has her own company. She is out of Detroit, Michigan, as well as this other lady. She's out of Detroit, Michigan. Um, the one young lady, she makes handbags. So this is for a lot of my ladies in the handbag community. When you guys get a chance, I want y'all to look her up. And her bags are called Glamaholic, okay? If you, if she's, it's black on, black woman, and she make bags. They're called Glamaholic. It got G's all on it. And it's just a beautiful, nice totes and bags and stuff like that. Then there's another lady out of Detroit who makes um, makeup as well as 
different glosses, oh, excuse me, and things of that nature. Oh, that was so rude. I'm sorry, y'all. Excuse me. <laughs> you know, we real and raw over here. <laughs> uh, she do lip glosses and stuff, okay? So, if you got social media, y'all done seen this. If you got Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, any of these things, y'all have seen this collaboration that has been done by two broads from Detroit, okay? One is representing lip bar, okay? The other one is representing Glamour Holly, which is handbags, okay? So they came together. So, this is the box that it came in. And look at this here, y'all. You see this here? Oh. This what comes with it. These are the two ladies that I'm talking about, okay? As you can see, their Twitter and Instagram and the name of their companies are at the bottom. Both of these beautiful young ladies are from Detroit. And if you ain't never know what that hairstyle is that they're rocking, those are called sculpture ponytails. We used to wear them back in the day. <laughs> you was the shit if you had a sculpture ponytail, okay? <laughs> okay, that was Detroit all day long. That or a crimp ponytail, okay? With the Chinese vine, okay? A quick read ponytail with the Chinese vine, okay? <laughs> but anywho, let me stick to this. So this is the product, and these two lovely black-owned businesses ladies have hooked up. Check them out. Okay, and guess what it says? It says, D-girls do it better. Okay? Yes, we do. They say D-girls do it better. Detroit. And um, visit them either on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. Um, the one lady, her name, her handle is Glamaholic Lifestyle. It's G L A M A H O L I C Lifestyle, and the other lady is the Lip Bar. Okay, so let me show you that. So you all can see. Check them out. Ah, I just ordered mine. And this is what I ordered. Okay. Now, the bag, as you all can see, has the G on it. So that is the collection that was from the lady from um, Glamaholic. And the three lip glosses. And they have different names for the lip gloss. So I'm going to read to y'all what it says. So, it says, the D-Girl Collection. This is called the D-Girl Collection. <clears throat> it says, what up, though? That's our word. If you know anybody from Detroit, they say, what up, though? <laughs> so, they says, what up, though? You scored a limited edition D-Girl Collection by... TLB and Glamaholic Lifestyle, inspired by the glam style of 90s Detroit. Wasn't nobody fucking with the D in the 90s, okay? We was Coogee Down, Pink Steam Gators, and if you really was a diva, baby, you had your fantasy boots. <laughs> baby, ain't nothing like it, okay? I ain't even trying to take y'all down memory line, okay? But this collaboration is inspired from the 90s, okay? So it says, inspired by the glam style of 90s Detroit, this banging beauty bundle will have you serving looks on the go in and on time. We can't wait to see you rock your Hi, shine. You know I love me a lip gloss, honey. <laughs> we can't wait to see you rock your high shine lip. Your high shine lip and showing the world D girls do it. So the three different lip glosses. One is called Buffs. 
So, if you all are familiar with the Midwest, because it's not just Detroit. You got Chicago, you got Ohio, you got Milwaukee, St. Louis, a little touch of Kentucky. Um, What else is the Midwest? Um, Anyway, the mid everybody in the Midwest kind of, we all kind of got the same kind of like style. But, um, Detroit just, we a little bit different than everybody else in the Midwest, okay? So, they have something called buffs. So, are you familiar with their glasses? They're like Cartier glasses, but we call them buffs. Now, if you old school, if you from the old school like me, the, re, the how you got the, you, you had buffaloes, okay? Them was the big rounds, okay? The circles, them was the buffaloes, okay? <laughs> Back in my day, you had definitely had to be strapped up, okay? Rocking some damn cardies. Now, it's a little bit easier because they got fake cardies, okay? So, a lot of these niggas out here be rocking fake-ass cardies or that bullshit. But back in my day, they were snatching them bitches. The motherfuckers was getting killed over them. So, me personally, I don't really particularly rock them. You know, I like them and I love them to see my niggas in them, okay? <laughs> baby, they gonna get some, baby. They know how it go. We love, us D-girls, we love it, okay? We love to see our men in they buffs and, and they cardies and stuff. So, anyway. But I don't wear them because just so many, back, back in my day, you had the cardi boys, you had, like, it was a whole movement before, a whole way before everybody else got hip. To what was going on? Everybody be out, y'all be out here swagger jacking too, still, still in Detroit swag and stuff. Okay, y'all still be coming up there getting cards and putting dabs, dabs in your cards and stuff. But if you was really old school before the nineties when everybody was rocking the cards, back in the eighties they was rocking what you call golden wood. Okay, now I still rock them because a lot of that's you that's that's. That's old school. You don't, you, a lot of folks don't know about that. But before the car just really was popping, Nick, people was rocking the golden woods. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, she got one gloss in here called Buffs. She got another called Stink Pink. Okay. The players from the Himalayas. I say Jerome the house. <laughs> The players from the Himalayas, baby, they rocking their pink stink gators and they ostrich skins and eel skins and snake skins. And they was pink stink gators by Detroit players, okay? If the hair by Biggie did air night, Papa been smooth since days the under room. <laughs> okay, you want to ask somebody? You know that's my boo right there, baby. That's Team Wallace, baby, because I'm a Wallace. Y'all better act like y'all know up in here, okay? Um, spritz. Spritz, you know, hair spritz for, you know, for your hair and stuff. Now, in the city, you had different types of hairstyles. That's how you knew where a female was from. Now, some girls, they wore their spritz. You had your spritz hairstyles. If it was real spritzy and hard and crunchy, they called it crunchy. Now, me, I, I grew up on the west side, but I love the east side, okay? I love my east side. And, baby, I go to the east side and get my hair done because I like my spritz and I like my crunch. <laughs> west side, your shit be soft. They more into the soft hair. East side was more into the spritzy type hairstyle. So, that's how you knew what side of town a female was from based off her hair, okay? Um, just giving y'all a little bit about the city if you ain't never been to the day. But this is what's in the uh, package. See here, those are the different colors. This is the bag. These are the three lip glosses and these are the names of the colors. Um, this retail for about, I wanna say, how much should I pay? I want to say... Oh, I can't remember, y'all. I'm going to be... Let me see if it's a receipt in here. So, okay, that's all of that. 
Um, and then here in the box here, these are the glosses here. And these are the glosses from the lip bar. So isn't that cute? Look at that. That is just so nice. Look how it slide out. You see that? Oh, y'all did y'all motherfuckers. I'm cussing. They did their thing on this. Come on, Detroit. <laughs> they did that. Okay. You see how they slide out like that? Boom. These the three glosses. I'm gonna put them on too, so y'all can tell me which one is cute. Oh, thumbs up this video. Subscribe to my channel. Thumbs up the video. It's been a minute, y'all. I'm being real extra today because I'm a little buzzed up. Plus, I'm a little pissed off. I don't want to get on here telling my personal damn business and shit. But these hoes done got on my motherfucking <laughs> So, if you follow my channel and you watch my videos, y'all already know YouTube is therapeutic for me, okay? So I get on here and talk to my shit because it's therapeutic for me. And people can comment. You can comment if you don't want to comment. You ain't got to comment, but it's all good. And yes, I'm a city girl, but I'm country. I'm Southern. I'm definitely always been Southern. Even growing up in the city, they used to tease me coming up. Why you sound so country? Why you sound so Southern? I can't help that. My granny was from the South, so, um, but I'm city, trust, but I definitely got my Southern twine. I can't help that. I've been like that my whole life. So anyway, now this is the dust cover that the bag comes in from the lady uh, glam a -holic. So this is the lady with the G glam -holic. And the TLB stands for lip bar. So they teamed up. So this is what you get for the $90. You get, and she got a coupon. If you get the coupon, you won't have to pay this. But I just paid full price because I just was like, fuck it, I ain't gonna be no cheap ass bitch. I'm gonna pay full price. So the lady from the lip bar, she offered the glosses. These are the three glosses that's offered in the pack, in the uh, package of them teaming up and then this is going to be the bag I'm going to reveal from Glamour Holly. This is the dust cover that it comes in. It's a beautiful um, pink stink. Okay. Actually, this ain't pink stink. To me, this color will be considered more of a fuchsia pink. Pink stink was kind of like oh it was almost like a pale pink. I can't explain it, but, um, yeah, it was the shit. Okay, so I'm unboxing, taking this out, and this is the actual bag. Let's open it. I'm opening it for you all here on YouTube. So what's been going on? How's everybody doing? I hope everyone been fine. Hugs and kisses to everyone. I'm sorry I've been absent. I know y'all like, girl, is she still doing video? Oh, you know what this remind me of? This remind me of back in the day when the aunties and them used to be having them little makeup love. Oh, ain't that cute? Look at this, y'all. This is from Glamaholic. Okay, Google her. Look. See her. See her. Google her. Glam her. Okay, ain't this so cute? This would be a nice little makeup pile. Or if it's summertime, you got a cute little dress and you had like a little, you can carry this if you going to like a, uh, you carry this to the white part, like a white party or something, even though it ain't white, it's pink. But you just want something cute and fly and flirty, you know? And you just, boom. And then it unzips here. Let's see. Now, you know the ones that um, aunties and them, the aunties and them used to carry. It used to have a mirror right here. That's what y'all, now, ooh. Um, Glamour Hall, it, now that's what you should've did. You should've put a mirror inside of here, girl. 
Cause that's how they used to be back in the day. Cause my mama used to have one. <laughs> yes. Oh, and look y'all. It is so cute. This is inside. Look, it got a little pouch here. Um, and it got the um the um embroidery in the inside. TLB. Yes, that's the only thing, um, uh, Miss Glamour Holly. You should come out with another one of these, sis. Come out with a bigger one, right? But you got to put a mirror right here. Oh, that's what y'all was out. See, now, if y'all would have had me on y'all team, I would have told you how they really were. Because my mama used to carry a purse like this. And it used to have a mirror right here. And you would put your makeup and your little stuff in here. And when you out at the club, at the cabaret, because, you know, back in the day, they did the cabarets and shit. <laughs> and, baby, you would unzip this. And then, boom, you put your lip gloss and your lipstick on and you had your mirror right here and you would look in your mirror. That's the only thing you missing with this, uh, sis. Dang. But it's still the shit. I support you. I support you all. I'm going to order another bag, too, from you. But that's the only thing you should have. You should have put a You needed a mirror right here. That's the only thing you looking for. Whoever your um, team, they should have told you. Because I know. My aunties and them used to carry these, baby. Back in the day. And if she... And, oh, now y'all finna have me on here telling too much. But, yes. <laughs> you should have put a mirror right here. That's the only thing that was... Missed. Other than that, it's beautiful. I love the color. This is the bag. It has the embroidery here. The G with the stitching. This is the back of it. This is the inside. It got a slight pocket. It's satin. And it zips around. See here? Hmm. Look at that, child. Y'all y'all be better get with it. Look, and then got the little embroidery with the little tag on the side. Y'all better get with this right here. Now, see, this is good for me, too, because I'm I travel. And as a traveler, this is perfect. You could put stuff in here. I'm not gonna put makeup in there, but you can put stuff in here and carry it. You know, little cute little stuff. I just love this. This is cute. But next, you need to come out with another one on your own with your own collection. When you do your, with your own collection, and make sure you put a mirror in here, cause that's the only thing y'all was missing was a mirror. Why y'all didn't put a mirror in here? That's the only thing. Other than that, I love the collection. Everything is beautiful. So this is the bag you get. It's embroidered. It's so cute. And please look them up. The lady who makes these bags. Because she has other bags. This is just a special collaboration that they did. But she has some nice tote bags. Drawstring bags. She got all kind of nice bags. So check her out. Okay. Um, my girl over there, um, Glamour, um, Holic Lifestyle. Check her out on Twitter, Instagram, all that stuff. My girl over here at the lip bar, she got all types of shades of makeup. Hold on, because I'm dropping shit. Hold on. <laughs> makeup, lip glosses, all of that. Okay, so I'm going to try the lip gloss on for y'all now. Hold on, let me put this back in here because I don't want to be fucking up. Hold on, let me put this back. But ain't this cute, y'all? The only thing, you needed a mirror right there. And you really would have been doing it like back in the day. Because, baby, they had the mirror at the top up here. <laughs> That's the only thing. Other than that, y'all did y'all thing. But I wouldn't give a damn if you had the mirror or didn't have the mirror. I wouldn't care. I'm supporting my sister. So, boom. That's the bag. Okay. And this is the dust, the beautiful dust cover. See here, this is the dust cover that it comes in. So, I'm going to put this back in the dust cover. Okay. And then... 
I'm going to try on the different lip glosses from the lip bar and let you all know what um and you just let y'all comment comment like subscribe to the videos comment like subscribe tell me what y'all think about the collaboration you ain't got to be from detroit you ain't got to be a d girl to have a d swag but just now you ain't gonna never be able to do it like a detroit bitch but <laughs> If you want to do get some of the swag and some of the sauce, you feel me? Because y'all be swagger jacking out here. Y'all been still in Detroit style for a long time. We started Ghetto Fabulous and all of that. That started in Detroit. God. It was other cities. D.C. It was D.C., Detroit, Florida. Um... Back in the 90s, them was like the main little spot. Philly, fit definitely Philly. Philly, DC, Detroit, and Florida. Had hand, ghetto fabulous, hands down, baby. But Detroit, we the originators of it, okay? <laughs> so check this out, okay? Okay, so let me show y'all the, the lip glosses, okay? So boom. Okay, these is the three lip glosses. And one is called Spritz. One is called um, Spink Pink. And the other one is called Buffs. So these are the names of the three glosses. So I'm gonna put I'm gonna put them on so y'all can tell me what y'all think. So the first one I'm gonna put on is going to be buffs okay because we stay gated up mm -mm. the city where we love to shine <laughs> oh boy <laughs> you got to be from the city to know these okay <laughs> yes honey so come roll with a nigga get high with a nigga come stacks with a nigga so come roll with it. Okay. Yes, niggas is tripping, slipping in the dope guy. Baby, you got to be from the city to know all about all this. <laughs> Baby, we had our own music, everything. So all this, the, the, now the new Detroit music and the new Detroit wave, I'm so proud of everybody. They doing their thing. But you know, back in the day, niggas was going platinum right in the city because they ain't give a fuck about all that. And then special shouts out to my uh, Rock Bottom and all them. I fucks with them too. Big Herb, that's my nigga. Everybody, oh, I love everybody. East or West Side. Okay, so this one is called um, Buffs. Okay. Like the glasses. Okay, so, okay I'm gonna put it on y'all. Let me get up close so y'all can see. Hold on. Mm, I don't want to put too much on. Hold on. Okay. Oh, it's light. Sorry. <laughs> no, but it's pretty. It's light. It's real light. Glossy. And I like it smooth on the lips, too. You know... <laughs> Oh, I've been drinking. <laughs> I was going to say something. <laughs> Excuse me, you two, world. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's smooth on the lips. Mm -hmm. It ain't real. You know how some gloss, you put it on, put the gloss on, it be real thick, like, and you got to be lying. This ain't like this. It glad I'm real smooth. So, so all my Detroit divas, you already know when I'm to where I'm going with that. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> this is the kind of gloss you kiss your nigga with, like, <laughs> and other things. You know, if you into that, but you know what I'm trying to say. It's a nice smooth gloss. Glossy. Okay, so that's um buzz. Bitch, I like that one. Mm-hmm. Okay, so now I'm finna put on 
pink stain. Okay, let me put that one on. So I'm gonna wipe this one off. Hold on. I ain't got no. You know what? I was tired. So let me just, I gotta tell y'all. I've been working. I'm tired as hell. And, um, I had to commute and I drove. I was like, I ain't did no YouTube. You know, I was like, I'm finna go on motherfucking YouTube. I'm having my drink. I'm out here venting with y'all. So this video is gonna be all over the place. And it's probably gonna be a little ghetto. But please forgive me and just know that I love y'all. Okay. So let me wipe this off. Oh, boom. I So the first one was buffs. I like how that how that slid on. <laughs> okay, so now this one is pink stink gators by Detroit players. Tim's from a hooligans in Brooklyn. That's right. It's the head by Biggie did and I. I'm been smooth since days the under rule. And y'all know uh bad boy and all that stuff, you know, like back in our day. You know when they had harmony records and like the record shops and stuff where you would go and Ticketmaster, like I'm from that era, honey. So, um, Puffy with your fine chocolate. That wait, hold on. Love, Mr. Love, honey. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Love had uh, a record shop in the hood on Finkel. If you from the hood, you know it was right next to, um, Cooley on Finkel. It was called Justin Records and it was named after his son, Justin. And it used to be popping in the 90s. You hear me? Everybody who was on Bad Boy or anybody, or not just on Bad Boy, whoever was popping or whatever would come to the city and they would be up there. You would go up there and buy their um, cassette tape or CD. Okay, before Apple motherfuck music. <laughs> And you would go up there. It was the shit. Okay, now this is Pink Stink Gators. Oh, I think I really like this one. Hold on now. Hold on now. Hold on now. Come on, lip bar. I like her lip glosses. They real smooth like. Oh, I'm going to order some more stuff. Oh, yeah. And I like that it's light and real juicy. Just make you feel juice. Juicy. <laughs> yeah. Juicy. Mm, mm, mm. Juicy. Yeah, I like that, bitch. That made me feel juicy, bitch. <laughs> Uh, but that's called pink, a stink, stink pink, Davis. By all my Detroit players. And then the last one is Spritz. Uh, it's just clear. I ain't gonna put that one on, but it's just clear, a clear gloss. So you got, and and that's called Spritz. So you got this one called Spritz, as y'all can see. And then you got this one called Pink Stain. They go on real smooth. And I wear a lot of lip gloss. Okay, baby. I wear Estee Lauder. Call me old school. Call me Auntie Young. Bitch, I like my Estee Lauder. Okay. I wear MAC lip gloss. I wear uh, L'Oreal, the CVS shit. Um, but this here gloss, I'm telling you, if you into lip gloss, this some good ass gloss because I like how smooth, how it, it just, it's so smooth. Y'all got to support them, support them. I love how it go on. Because like, even with my, um, when I wear my Clinique and my, um, uh, Estee Lauder, and baby, she is, uh, $36 a tube, okay? She don't go on this smooth. <laughs> So yeah, this is the packaging. I love the packaging. Look at this, you all. This is the packaging. This is the dust cover for the bag. I showed you all the bag. Um, 
these are the two beautiful young ladies. Okay, D girls do it better. This is their handle at the bottom. Just click on their Instagram or Facebook or Twitter, check them out. These are the products that I came to you all about on the bag, which is the bag by Glamaholics and the three glosses by the lip bar. They go on really nice. This is a beautiful collaboration. I had to get it because I'm <clears throat> living it because uh, I, um, you know, love the 90s. I love the 90s. Like, the 90s was the shit. Even though I was in school, I was still in school in the 90s. I'm only 39. But I act old as hell, but y'all yeah, love the 90s. That's when the, when the niggas was spending that money on bitches. <laughs> You can't even get these niggas to do nothing now. <laughs> Back in the day. Baby, bitches was getting wash and dryer sets and you know. If you was a D girl and you fucked with a nigga from the D, you already know what I'm talking about, baby. They was cash you out. And if you was fucking with an east side nigga and you was from the west side like me, first thing he tell you, just pull up. <laughs> Dusty and dirty. Well, guess what he gonna, he gonna tell his homies. He gonna be like, she, I got my, I got my West Side bitch. She finna come scoop me up, nigga. Soon as you gonna pull up on his ass, boom. He gonna be looking dusty and dirty, but he gonna have a pull out a nine of money on your motherfucking ass. You'll be like, oh, but grab with me up to this east side. So I gonna pick up this money. <laughs> Now, West Side niggas, they a little different. Now, they spend on a bitch. You know, they, they more take up, you know, they more wine and dine type of a bitch. But be stunting all at the same time. <laughs> but you know, you love them too. Because you know, they going to show you a good time. And West Side niggas will show you a good time too. But the difference between, it's a difference between the two. I love them all. East Side or West Side. I done fucked with all kind of niggas. East Side, West Side. Bitch, you name it, bitch. But anyway, enough about me. We're talking about the product here, okay? Because <laughs> I'm getting off course because I've been drinking. And I just needed to vent. So check them out. Check this product out. This was an unboxing from Glamaholic and the lip bar. Check them out. Something fabulous coming out of Detroit. Okay, now also I ordered something else I wanted to come to y'all about. It's a perfume. Now, baby, this is a throwback too. Now, this ain't come out in the 90s. This perfume came out back in 2010. It's an old, it's, yeah, that's considered old school now because we in 2022. So, oh, but it smells so good. Now, I had got it from Marshalls, okay? Marshalls or TJ Maxx. I like my throwbacks, okay? Because I ain't be, cause I love perfume, but my thing is, I don't be wanting to spend a whole lot of money. Now, I like my expensive shit, too. Now, don't get me wrong. I go in there and spend, the most I'm going to spend, I did spend, I mean, it's maybe 200 for a bottle of perfume. Baby, this here, I ain't spending a whole lot of money. And it's a throwback, okay? But I got, I get so many condiments. And it smells so good with my body chemistry. So I thought I would come on here and share this with y'all. But it's hard to find. Like I said, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, or you gonna have to go on. I don't go to, I don't fuck with perfume, the perfume manias and all. I don't fuck with that. So this came from, this came from Wally World. But baby, when I tell you this here, and you know it's old school. Elizabeth Arden, bitch. <laughs> you know that that's when you went to, back when it was called Marsha Fields. <laughs> Macy's, honey. Elizabeth Arden, honey. You know that's what the rich, rich, that's what the rich bras used to wear back in the day. Elizabeth Arden, honey. But baby, this with her smells so good. It's called Pretty. 
And baby, you feel pretty when you got it on, baby. You just feel like a pretty ass. It just make you feel just so womanly, honey. I just love it. So I wanted to share that with y'all. Check this out, this perfume here. Well, no, I want y'all getting it. Cause see, I already had to order a bunch of them and they don't make it no more. It's discontinued, it's discontinued so I can't just go in the store and buy it, okay? But I just wanted to share this with y'all and tell y'all it smell good. So I want y'all heifers going out there buying it up. Um, Cause it's hard to find, okay? So, but. Check y'all throwbacks. And you know, it be some good ones. So I want to, oh, I got one more thing and then I'm getting off of here. Oh, this video get long because I've been rambling and I've been drinking this uh, drink. Okay, now, nah. did y'all know that they put Maya Angelou? Am I saying her name right? Because you know I'm ghetto. Uh, yeah, Maya Angelou. But you know, the the hood, we say Maya Angelou. <laughs> but it's actually pronounced Maya Angelou. <laughs> but we say Maya Angelou. <laughs> Do you all know for Black History Month, and if y'all be out there, fan, try to find y'all one. I've got me one. I'm going to try to find me like two more. They put her on the corner. Look at this, y'all. Oh, I don't know if y'all can see. Let's see. Well, I'm going to hold it like this. Can y'all see that? Well, look. Look at that. Hold on. I'm going to put it over here like this so y'all can see. Look at that. Wait, hold on. I'm going to let it focus. Wait, I don't want to knock my drink over. Hold on. Okay, now here. Let's see. I can't get it to focus and I'm buzzing. So, when y'all get a chance, cause Black History Month and came and once and a come and go again, okay? I didn't know nothing about them putting Maya Angelou on no 25 cent, on no quarter. I just so happened to be getting quarters and sent the quarter and I was like, Phenomenal woman, I am Maya Angelou. Honey, I was so gay. So, I think y'all should support this. Go if you at your banking institutions or if you out and about, be on the lookout for the quarter. The quarter was put in production February the 7th, 2022. We are currently in April. So there are quarters floating around with Maya Angelou. Okay. And it is so pretty. It can't y'all can't really see it, but it say Maya Angelou. Uh-huh. United States of America. Quarter dollar. And I just think that's fabulous. We got a black woman on the quarter. We have yet to get my girl, uh, Harriet Tubman. You know, they're going to get Harriet a hard time about that $20 bill. But we got Maya Angelou, phenomenal woman, honey. <laughs> so y'all need to get some of these quarters, honey, and support her. And with the movement, because I didn't know nothing about it. So chime in, um, people. And you ain't got to be part of the African American, the Black American community to support um, Maya Angelou. She was a phenomenal woman and a poet, honey. So she touched all lives, okay? So, um, yes, be on the lookout for those quarters, honey. I went to my bank today to try to find that. I couldn't find it, but be on the lookout. Um... And this is it, YouTube world. I just came on here to talk my shit. Tell y'all I'm still here. I'm still alive. I'm still with the humans. I haven't, I haven't 
been active and participating here on YouTube World, but I decided to go live today and let y'all know that I am here telling you all about um, the lip bar and telling y'all about um, glamorous lifestyle. And that's what we all want to live, a glamorous lifestyle. So yes, whether it's on a budget or off a budget, okay? We all got to pay our bills. We got to do what we got to do. I just thank y'all for tuning in. I had to get on this YouTube event because there's some shit I really wants to say. I really wants to say, and I really wants to talk my shit on here. But I'm not, okay? I'm going to be an adult and a respectful plumbing, okay, here on YouTube, disrespect me, okay, because I respect everybody and everything, okay, I don't care what you like to do, who you do, what you do, I respect everybody, we all got to go to work, we got to pay our bills, we got to do what we got to do to survive out here, we don't need no extra drama, it's unnecessary, so let's just leave that alone and let the people live them live their lives, okay? And please let me live mine. So I thank y'all for tuning in to my channel here on YouTube World. Q B E E Bianca B I A N K A. And if you really know me, you know that's how I'm coming, Bianca with a guy. <laughs> where I miss everybody. All my purse divas, excuse me. Because I'm buzzing. I'm sipping. I'm feeling good. And I'm talking some shit. But go on over there and check out Glam. Glamaholic. Yes. Glamaholic. Check her out. She got some bad ass totes, honey. Tote bags. That leisure. It be, she got them big like the... uh. MCM lids, reversible lids, and that type of shit. She got the big stupid one. I'm gonna get one. But they go so fast, so you got to be on, okay? Because you know how Detroit is. So we fuck with you, we fuck with you. So it is what it is. So her shit sell out quick. So check her out, okay? She got some cute stuff. I'm gonna tag her um website at the bottom of this video. The lip bar as well as Glamaholic. So y'all can click and see what, you know, what they got over there. That, um, you know, strike show a style show. But I had to get that little product right there because that was the shit. And I love their promotion and how they did it. Only thing they missed the marker was they didn't put a damn mirror inside the purse. When you unzip it, you supposed to have a mirror right there. Uh, that's the only thing. Other than that, everything is beautiful. So I thank y'all for tuning in to my channel. God bless. Hugs and kisses to everyone here on YouTube World. Continue to tune in to my channel. Give me some time. I'm going to come on here. I'm going to give you what you need when I can give it to you. But just stay tuned. Subscribe, like, thumbs up the video. And just know Miss Bianca love you all. Hugs and kisses and I thank everyone for tuning in to this video today here on YouTube World. I feel like I'm going to duck down so y'all can see me. I don't know if y'all can really see me. Okay. And this my real hair too, y'all. This ain't no wig. And I ain't no wig either, baby. This is my hair. Well, you can look at it and tell it's my hair. I don't even know why nobody would think it was a wig. It ain't no wig. It, it ain't nappy, but y'all don't forget what real hair look like. I don't guess that's my real hair, and I and I just want to thank y'all, hugs and kisses. And I'm getting up off of here because my um liquor is kicking in. I'm tired. I've been commuting. I had to work. I had to drive. Then I drove four hours. Then came and then decided to do this video. Oh, I done got turned out on Bojangles, y'all. Them damn um, Bowberry Biscuits. 
when I was in North Charlotte. Baby, them is good. <laughs> that is so good. When they fresh, oh, that is so good. With some chicken. Anyway, I enjoy myself today, honey. And I got my, um, my little drink and stuff. So to all my Detroit people, that fucks with me. Okay. Bright Mall, Seven Mile, Eastside, Mac B. Wick, uh, Lakewood, West Warren, East Warren. <laughs> I love y'all. You hear me? Love everybody. See the Grove, love y'all. Um, Schoolcraft, love y'all. Everybody. Finkle Ab, all that. Okay? So stop all the drama and the bullshit. Okay, and just know Miss Bianca love everybody, okay? Hugs and kisses and love y'all.